to my channel here we are doing the middle of the month love readings i just want to let you guys know we apologize for the late updates i know we update every 15th we are a bit behind but anyway so let's get into your reading capricorn let's see what's unfolding for you guys in regards to love and romance now when shuffling the deck the first card that came out is the the eight of wands so i'm going to shuffle one more time all right let's see what is unfolding for you now we have the eight of wands here with the two of pentacles the four of swords the eight of swords the four of wands and the three of pentacles partners cards or person of your interest the knight uh, sorry the king of pentacles the four of pentacles queen of pentacles ace of pentacles wow nine of cups and the ten of pentacles wow this is amazing energy you guys okay so off the bat what i'm seeing here is there was a situation or some type of news that recently came to you where you felt like it kind of um brought a bit of instability i feel that for some of you guys it could uh, have to do with rumors a lot of people having a lot to say in regards to uh, your relationship or in regards in general um in regards to your love life now the two of pentacles does indicate a bit of imbalance with the four of swords i feel that for I want to say the beginning of September for you guys is going to be um, the energy is going to be shifting greatly. Now, for some of you guys, this is you expecting or wanting to get news or hear from a person or someone that you were dealing with in the past where there was uh, some type of temporary separation, some type of ending here. Um, and this is you basically weathering the storm. This is you wanting to hear from them, still holding on to the hope um, and it's almost like a feeling of being stuck um, and, and again, being very hopeful, hopeful in wanting to solidify or wanting to stabilize some type of connection here. However, with the eight of wands, what they're telling me is that in the uh, beginning of September is when you're going to be getting news or you're going to be hearing um, news about the person of your interest or the person that you were dealing with in the past. Now, there is, again, it's almost like you being in the state of mind of wanting to put effort and energy. Now, for those of you guys that are single, um, I feel that there's been this place of, or you've been in this mental state of mind where you're putting all your effort and energy towards other projects and other endeavors only to keep you distracted from a situation that you feel has come to a halt or there's no movement there. For some of you guys, this could even be feeling like there hasn't been much of excitement when we're talking about love and romance. Um, and it's almost like feeling the feeling the lack of, you know, the lack of excitement in your love life. And it's like I am going to distract myself by overworking or pushing myself or trying to achieve goals and aspirations so that you don't have to deal with the emotions that come with feeling i want to say not necessarily lonely but feeling alone now the positive thing here is if you can see on this side this is the person that you're dealing with or the person that's coming towards you we have two uh we have a couple the the queen and the king of pentacles so this is indicating to me a very deep connection this could be a soul type of connection um, this is basically the yin and the yang type of energy here. And right at the center, we see the four of pentacles. So the four of pentacles could signify being reserved. And I feel that it's almost like a mirroring type of energy. Now, this could be the person that you're dealing with that, you know, you haven't heard from or there hasn't been much movement. And it's almost like feeling like you've hit a wall. You don't know exactly where this is progressing. However... They are saying that um, this individual could be doing work of their own, meaning working through certain certain things that they need to work through, whether it's in their career, whether it's in their personal life, basically getting their shit together. Um, and I do see the offering coming through. They definitely do see you, Capricorn, as uh, the prize to behold. They see you as a person that they can build something with uh, there is wish fulfillment here and there's also the ten of pentacles so you go from 
the ace to the ten of pentacles this is an indication of a new beginning that is going to lead to some type of commitment some type of marriage um basically meeting the person you've been hoping or wishing for and this is again like i said it can start to manifest for you from now all the way to september but i feel that what they're showing me here is again the ace of pentacles is present next to the nine of pentacles for those of you guys out there that have been working very hard towards some type of manifestation or towards bringing to you or finding the person that you're not really i don't see you guys really looking to waste your time anymore capricorn i see you guys very focused and determined knowing exactly what it is that you're looking for in a partner and the ace is a representation of a new beginning this is a new offer this is a new person coming into your life with the nine of pentacles that is going to bring to you a lot of wish fulfillment a lot of your wishes a lot of your dreams and desires or aspirations when we're talking about relationships they will be giving that to you they will be bringing that into your life um, starting something that is going to be built on a strong solid foundation that is going to lead or may lead for some of you guys to marriage so this is a very beautiful type of energy um, my advice is when you start to feel like you're getting to the point of exhaustion um, or frustration even uh, because you feel you know melancholy or you're feeling a bit nostalgic Try the best you can to redirect your energy, focusing on the future, being excited about what's to come for you, because I do see some type of wish fulfillment here. Now, for those of you guys that have been dealing with someone and there's been some type of separation, I definitely do see them coming back around trying to bring you an offer. Now, when I see the Ace of Pentacles, I always get excited because this is an indication of something that has the potential for long term. Um, so we have the Ace of Pentacles being offered uh, and it's bringing to you the wish fulfillment or the hope or the wish that you've been asking for with the Ten of Pentacles. This is the culmination. This is the, again, like I said, starting to build something on a solid foundation that ultimately leads to long-term potential. So again, very beautiful energy Capricorn. I wish you guys the very best and we'll see each other soon. Bye.